How often do we find ourselves asking, how can we find peace in these difficult times? In a world filled with turmoil, it seems an elusive quest, doesn't it? Jesus Christ, in his infinite wisdom and compassion, provided a comforting answer to this age-old query. In John 14, 27, he said, Peace I leave with you, my peace I give you. I do not give to you as the world gives. Do not let your hearts be troubled and do not be afraid. The peace Jesus speaks of is not the worldly peace we often equate with tranquility, a pause in conflict, or a fleeting moment of calm. No, this peace is far more profound. It's a divine peace, a gift from God himself. It's a peace that transcends circumstances, a peace that steadies the heart and soul even in the midst of life's fiercest storms. This peace is not dependent on external conditions, but is rooted in the unchanging nature of God himself. Jesus makes a clear distinction between his peace and the world's peace. He says, I do not give to you as the world gives. The world's peace is temporary, contingent on circumstances, and often leaves us wanting more. In contrast, the peace Jesus offers is eternal, steadfast and complete. This divine peace is not just the absence of trouble, it's the presence of God. When Jesus says, do not let your hearts be troubled and do not be afraid, he's inviting us to trust in him, to cast our worries onto him. He's assuring us that his peace is always available, even in the midst of our difficulties. So, how do we tap into this divine peace? First, we need to focus on God through prayer. As E. Harvey once said, a day without prayer is a day without blessing, and a life without prayer is a life without power. Engage in an ongoing dialogue with God. Share your troubles with Him, and let His peace wash over you. Second, put yourself in a place of worship. Instead of fixating on your problems, shift your focus to worshiping God. This shift in perspective can bring about a profound sense of peace. Third, remember the attributes of God. He is all-knowing, all-powerful, dependable, a healer, a provider, and merciful. Remembering who God is can bring comfort and peace in times of uncertainty. Finally, give thanks to God. Even in the midst of trials, there's always something to be grateful for. Find it and thank God for it. In conclusion, the peace we seek isn't found in the world, in wealth, or in human efforts. It's found in God alone. As Jesus said, Peace I give to you. This divine peace is available to us all. We need only to turn to God, trust in Him, and receive his peace. So remember, no matter how troubling the times, do not be afraid, for the peace of God is with you.